That's a feeling that you can't explain. It, uh, like you, you know, you you start when you're a little kid um, riding a snowmobile in the backyard, and then um, things start to get more serious, and you're like, oh man, I, I wish that one day I could I can win a, a pro final, and I, I want to be like the best guy, and and then you get to the moment where you actually get to win a pro final, and like for for that night you are the the number one guy. That. Um, that, that's what everybody that's on the track works for. Um, everybody, you know, you spend so much time in the gym, you spend so much time testing, um, you spend so much time just focusing on that one moment that, that lasts for, you know, that's a, that's a 12 minute race and, you know, I've, I've worked for that, that 12 minutes for 23 years. So it, uh, you know, it's, man, it's, there's a lot of work and a lot of emotion and a lot of, um, just a, yeah, just raw emotion that, that, that I was feeling in that. And um, yeah, I'm just, just definitely happy to have, have family with me in that moment. I feel like no, no matter what, <laughs> what part of the year you're in, um, I feel like God is, is teaching you something in every single moment. Obviously winning is the ultimate goal. We want to win the championship, but um, without all those people behind me, there's, you know, there's really no reason to keep doing this. To be able to, to work as hard as I can for them, but also for myself as well, um, it, uh, yeah, that, that's probably what really drives me. The thing that I want to say is, is to be able to tell everybody, yeah, I'm going to win multiple races, but uh, you know, at the end of the day, I'm, I'm not in control of that. I'm going to do everything that I can to, to put myself in the best position possible, and I know that the guys behind me on the team are going to um, give me the best sled that I can possibly have. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to, you know, we're definitely going to have um, a great machine, a uh, great snowmobile, um, training's going to be good, um, fitness, fitness wise I'll be in, in good shape and um, speed we're, we're going to work our butts off so we're going to try to try to try to uh, finish up front every single, as many races as we can. It'd be cool if we could do every single race but you know I don't want to get ahead of myself. I've only won one final so I'd uh, just, just try to get another one. I'd want the world to, you know, the snowcross world to remember um, I just want to be the guy that like people are like oh man he had Jesus like like that whole time he just trusted God and he trusted his plan for them no matter how the season went no matter how the race went he he was always you know he always pointed to to God and he like uh, for me that means a lot to me um, that might not be what a lot of people want to hear but um, yeah personally that uh, I just want to try to glorify God and, and do everything that I can to to bring people towards him and uh, at the end of the day if I you know, get win the championship, or if I get tenth in the championship, I, I'm always going to give all the glory to God and um, you know point to Him for everything. I think if I were to to tell myself 10 or 15 years ago that this is where I would be, I man, I don't know. That uh, yeah, that's that's something that I always worked for. Boy, it's it's been busy. I um, I've been back and forth from Minnesota to to Arizona to Vermont, and um, I had to go to, to Minnesota to help with um, uh, some farming uh, with with my in-laws, and then back to Vermont to help with my parents uh, or, or with my dad to to help him with some work, and um, kind of just been bouncing around. Um, got to spend probably in the middle of the summer. I got to spend about a month and a half um, in Arizona. Typical week is pretty uneventful um i'll i'll wake up and um yep i'm a stay-at-home husband when i'm when i'm here so utilize it as much as i can and spend as much time at the chiropractor as i can as much time at the gym and um, just being able to recover and a lot of training benefits that we can get out of um, training in the heat and, and the elevation that we have here and um, everything like that so there's it's um it's been a fun summer for sure and um, definitely, definitely uh, grateful for the, the time that we've been able to spend here.